what we have discussed like these three options we already discussed and here it's we command and these options we already covered <coughs> okay see here uh, in this first option only we can we have to specify the profile like what kind of sweep to create in remaining things we don't require any like what we can say profile just we have to specify the guide curves i think curves we have to specify based on that curve only it will create your surfaces we already discussed this thing also yesterday the next thing i am going here is circles it's related to circle see here here also just we have to specify the guide curves automatically it will create your surface according to your requirement okay the for that one what we have to do means we have to see in every option here you can find the options like three guides two guides center two guides center and radius two guide tangent surface one guide tangent surface limit curve and tangent surface so like that i can find some options uh, i am going to the first option here that is three guides so we require three curves here so by joining those three curves it will create one surface so for that reason what i will do uh, i will create three lines here the first line i am creating by using the option like point and direction the first point i am creating around somewhere um, y axis the t straight entity i am giving here okay direction i am giving like x axis mirror extent Okay. The first line I created here, and now I am creating the second line. Like directly, I will go for where option. Where I will be clear. Why should I create again and again? Okay, and one more line I am creating here. Yeah, now see here, guys. <clears throat> now see here, I have three guide curves here. Okay. So by joining these three curves, I have to create one surface, and it should be like a circle. So in that case, we have to go for this sweep command. Use the option three guide curve. This is my first guide curve. This is my second guide curve. This is my third. Now see here, automatically it will by joining those three guide curves, it will create one surface. Okay. Yes. Okay. Understand this one? So like that, we can able to create the surfaces. Okay. So like that, I can able to create my surface, the first surface. Then next again, I am going for the next option that is mine. Two guides and radius. So the two guides I am giving is 
my first guide, this is my second guide, then we have to specify the radius, how much we required. I am giving radius like 30 for example, click preview. Now see here it is creating these much surfaces. So which one you want, you have to select here and it will create your surface. For example, I want this surface for example. Okay, so that surface is passing through those two curves and it has a radius of 30. Okay, so like that we can able to do this. See here, radius is 30. So like that we can able to create the surface. And the next thing again I am going for the sweep command. The next option you can find center and two angles. Like we have to specify the center curve. I am giving this is my center curve. Reference surface means which surface we have to Sorry, reference curve means with which curve you want to make a measure angle. I am selecting this is my measuring angle. Then how much angle you want can you specify that will create your surface. Now see here, this is your center curve. And this is the curve from where the surface is starting. And it's creating with 45 degrees. Angle. How much angle you want you can even specify. For example, I am giving here 90 degrees. Okay, 90 degrees you can able to specify or you can able to specify here 80 degrees. Uh, 60 degrees. Uh, 70 degrees. Okay, so like that we can able to specify the angle, how much you require for that circular surface. Okay, understand this one. So like that we can able to do here. <clears throat> Again, I am going for the sweep command. Go for sweep. The next option you can find center and radius means just try to specify the center of your. Uh, for example, for that one, what I will do? I will create one sketch here on this plane. And I'm creating one spline here. Exit workbench. Now see here, I have to create one surface according to this path, and the surface is circular one. So in that case, there is no need of creating any sketch. Directly go for sweep. Use the option center and radius. Center is my this one. Radius I'm giving like don't give 30, just give 10 only. Why? Because it will make some twisting there. Now see here, automatically it will create your surface like that. <coughs> Suppose for example, if you have this circular kind of thing, there is no need of creating 